Vitali is uh, blustery in beak and uh, full of pride and ego, and he's he's definitely the alpha male of the whole circus. And um, someone playing that bu- could go buffoonish, and at times he does, but he's he's a big character, a big personality, and so you can basically do no wrong. You're just blasting out. You sometimes, you know, hurting the recorder's ears uh, with with the the volume. Um, but it's been fun because we'll get to the script and we'll do the the written words, and then we'll we'll be able to go off it a little bit. And you have an idea of what you want to do, and throw out a couple different versions and a couple ideas. And and it's great because they they make us feel that we can do no wrong. And you know, just go ahead, go on, go off on your own, and we'll circle back around, get get what we need to get, and then you know, oftentimes we'll find some little gem or some little response that works well. He was a, a Russian tiger, and so I I just tapped into my Russian guy, like this guy, and I thought, and by I looked at the the early on animation of it, and I thought, yes. I think he. I think you know the the Russian growl, uh, the tiger's growl would be in there. So I just drop it like this, yes, and so yet. And then I just played around with the certain things. I didn't know how they were going to go for it, but you know certain words like the word circus, I just made it circus. <laughs> I just it just sounded funny and fun to say, so it became circus, not circus. When last we left our heroes, um, they're on the run, and um, they're being chased, and they're still not back home. So uh, they get to, they're, they're almost captured, and they need a place for refuge. And they're right at the moment where they're going to be captured. Where can we go? Where could, you know, zoo animals hide out? Where? And then right behind them is this circus train with all the animals pictures on the circus train and it's like ta-da and then I pop out and the rest of the circus animals pop out and uh, some are welcoming them into the fold because they are our brothers and sister animals and some like me Vitaly's very very dubious about their intentions Vitaly in his prime he had a fantastic act. They say, impossible. I say, no, it's not impossible. And what he did is there was a ring that he would run and jump through the ring. But we light the ring on fire. And then as soon as the audience goes, wow, he ran and j- jumped through the ring in several rings. And then he'd make the rings smaller and get smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller, <laughs> and smaller rings until... It was a ring like that, you know, and then he would actually somehow be able to run and dive through this ring and make it through. It was quite a quite a feat. And uh, and then he lost his confidence. And like with anything, and I think this is the good lesson for, you know, that's couched in entertainment in the movie is that it's your confidence takes you far in life. And that's what happens not only in the circus animals, but in the zoo animals. They, they gain their confidence back and their friendships, and that together gets them through rough times.